guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to another vlog with your girl essence janae it's 2024 i really hope you guys had a good new year i definitely did i didn't do anything crazy i really was just very chill and relaxed and i feel at peace and I'm just ready to tackle the new year and I hope you guys are feeling the same. So this morning, um, I am doing a little work on the computer right now, but I am gonna be heading out soon. I need to run to Michael's so that we can finally, finally, finally get this office together. I know I kind of left you guys hanging in the last vlog, but it was just taking a while um, to really get this office together. We did do some stuff like, hang up the picture lights which you can't see right now they're actually charging but we did hang those well i say we we is one too many people my girlfriend hung the picture lights for me what else did she do i feel like she did something else but i don't remember also i have made an executive decision which is why i have to go to michael's in the first place i am not going to do like printed artwork I'm gonna actually make my own. Cause I really enjoyed making the artwork that's in the living room right now that has been there for a while. So if you guys keep up with the vlogs, you know what I'm talking about. But I enjoyed making that and I really wanna do it again for in here. Not black though, I think I'm gonna do black border and then the abstract art, if you will, is gonna be white. So I don't know if I'm gonna have to paint it white or We'll just see when we get to that step, but today I need to run to Michael's so I can get the canvases and I do need to pick up a small thing of paint because I don't think we have any more black paint from like the wall paint. So got to do that. Um, and I think that's it. That's really all I'm running out to do. And then we'll be back and we can start on that because I do want to start doing that. I also want to get the office together today. Finally, it's only taken but so long, but we're going to get it done. I promise and I'm gonna finally show you guys the desk because that came out weird but what I was saying was I'm gonna finally show you guys the desk nothing new in 2024 still can't talk I'll let you guys know when I can but it's so beautiful and I do want to show you guys that I know I left you guys on a cliffhanger so I'm gonna finish up these emails I'm gonna eat a little lunch and my girlfriend's actually calling so Michael's had everything that I needed I have my two canvases I went with the 24 by 36 um, it's pretty big pretty big but I think it's perfect for the space and where I'm gonna place them also I got a couple of other things right here that I needed as well they had everything I needed literally so I'm really happy about that I got some paint I've never used this before I always just use like the wall paint uh, whenever I'm painting anything including the other abstract art that I did for the living room this time I'm gonna be using this one because I don't think we have any more of the black and this is also in an eggshell finish which is the same as the wall which is more of like that matte look and yeah so that's why I picked this one and it also is a paint and sealer in one so it's a two-in-one which is great no priming no none of that Although I don't think that's necessary for the canvas, but whatever. And then I got these plastic cups just for me to put the paint into. That way I don't have to worry about making a mess or anything like that. 
and I also got a paintbrush. The reason why I picked up a new paintbrush is because the ones that we do have, we use for, like I said, the wall paint, actual wall paint and stuff like that. So I don't really know about craft paint. I don't even know if this is actual craft paint. I can't tell you to be honest, but I didn't want to take the chance and ruin one of the brushes that we do have. So I was just like, you know what, let me just buy one specifically for that and let that be that. So that's what I ran out and got. I'm really happy, like I said, that they had everything that I needed. I was debating with the frames, not the size per se, but they have frames with like a thicker border, kind of like this one right here. Um, this one I did get from Target. I didn't make this one personally, but the ones in the living room I absolutely made. Um, I didn't get the thicker border, number one, it was way more expensive than this one, and two, just because of the way it's going to be placed on the wall, I don't think it's necessary. It's not something I want to, like, stand out, if you will, so I'm okay with the size of this, and I think it's going to come out really, really good. Roxy, you tired? Homegirls over here huffing and puffing. Um, but anyway, so very, very excited. We're gonna, I think, start with the frames because basically what I'm gonna do is today I'm gonna paint the border and then I'm gonna let that dry before I actually do the abstract artwork on the main part of the frame. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna work with the black first and then, like I said, let that dry. We also need to get the office done, which I'm super excited for and ready to just be done with that or at least get started because you guys know the office is taking a little minute but we're getting there we're getting there and then um those are the two like main tasks for today on top of the fact that I do want to do some digital planning hopefully we can do some together I'm not like mastered in digital planning it's new to me but as I go along this journey you guys are coming along with me why am I moving my hand so much? Couldn't tell you. Anyway, let's get started before we lose daylight because I really want to get some of this stuff done. A lot of it done before the sun goes down because I'm trying to be to bed at a good time tonight. This is the piece that you cannot buy. Send me a love that you cannot mix. One is the joy that you cannot waste. And the other one price that you cannot fix. This is the piece that you cannot buy. just happened I know there was somebody probably cringing as I was painting with this white shirt on and I told myself I said essence change your shirt then I also said well you got this you're not gonna get paint on it y'all y'all see my shirt I'm gonna try and use the thing to get that out but I got some splashes of paint on me because I decided that I wanted to paint in a white shirt in a new white shirt at that I cleaned up most of it, but just look at the sink. Most of it is cleaned, but I still got some cleaning to do. But I don't know what made me. Oh, shoot. They turned the water off. Not good. All right, you guys, we're in the office. We are on the floor at the moment. You can kind of get a little sneak peek of what's going on in here. A mess. This is the desk, super, super happy with it. I will give you guys a better like preview of it. Um, I did get it from All Modern, or I didn't get it. My girlfriend got it for me for Christmas, but I did tell her the exact desk that I wanted. So yeah, that's that desk. It's so cute, so modern, just everything about it. Just yeah. what's there not to love? But um, I need to get this room together, finally. I did get a package, which I'm super excited to share with you guys. Um, but we're gonna do this first, and then we'll get to the package because it'll all make sense. Everything is just falling in place today. Yes, Roxy. You wanna say hi? Say hello. Say hi. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get this room together. I need to clear off the desk, set it up the way that I want it. My plan is to put the iMac in here 
normally that sits in my studio because I use it for a monitor, if you will, for my sit down videos, my get ready with me's. I use that so that way I can kind of like see myself bigger than using the little screen on the camera. We're going to do something different um, and I'm going to be without it. Well, not really, but I am because I'm moving it in here and the intention is to not use that as a monitor anymore. Things will make more sense as the vlog continues, but I'm going to put that in here. So I need to set that up in here. I need to figure out what I'm going to do with my nail stuff that I have because as many of you should know, I was doing my nails. Um, and then I recently started going back to the nail salon. I've gone twice already. So I don't think I'm going to be doing my own nails for a while. So I need to put this stuff up. And I'm thinking just to put it in the studio in the closet in one of those Alex drawers. But I need to clean this area up. Hey. Trips that you plan for the next whole week. It's too long for me, so cheap and your flex so deep, your sex so deep You got it girl, you got it hey. You got it girl, you got it yeah. Pretty little thing, you got a bag and now you calling You just took it off the line, no mileage Way they hitting you, the damn looking falling Talking while you come around and not in silence Flew the group of 17, no bodies if you guys remember i said i made a purchase on tiktok shop and i have the vanity mirror here i also have the lashes that i ordered from tiktok shop as well so let's just oh that felt weird i'm gonna open the lashes first Why do you look like something I had in my cart on Amazon? Ooh, this is long. These are the lashes. Very excited to uh, try these out. I obviously um, have lashes on right now that are kind of giving this style a little bit, not gonna lie. The ones I actually have on now, I didn't tell you guys about, but I got them from the, the hair store. And I actually really like them. These are no glue as well, so branching out trying different brands oh here is the box actually these these are the i envy one step press on method the style is glam day volume these are really nice this is what i have on my eyes currently and dare i say it i think these are actually a lot easier to put on than the kiss ones to be honest and i don't mean the the uh, kiss um with the bond and seal i mean the kiss press on ones are a little bit more tedious to put on than those ones those these went on like super fast super easy i don't know if it's just because i've had a lot of practice or because they were in fact really easy to put on but they were easy nonetheless all right enough chitter chatter let's unbox this mirror take all this tape off I'm opening this and my vanity isn't even cleared off, but I'm pressed. So this looks like it's the base. Okay, that's taped in there real good. So this is like the little base stand for it to go on with like a little mini um what do you call this microfiber kind of cloth screws this is the little mirror that you stick onto the vanity so you can look closer what do we have here the plug they gave you a screwdriver what I'm gonna do is put it together. I'm gonna clear off my vanity and then I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. So the vanity is put together or yeah, the vanity mirror 
is put together so it's right there the light is on it has three different modes which I'm excited for um, I do need to play around with like the setup and not the lights setup or anything but the setup in terms of like how it looks when you actually look at it and you're in my space and in my room but I do like it so far um, obviously the big like test of it all is gonna be when I film my content um, but just sitting here I like it, I like it a lot uh, three different settings so you guys can kind of see the light so it's kind of like on a cool setting right now and then it had, well actually this is more cool the other one I think was daylight that we were on and then this is more like that orange light that I don't really care for so between this one and this one I will play around with and see which one suits me best but yeah so far so good no complaints this is probably the brightest light and um i just love how i can see all of that it is 802 so i am gonna unwind i need to wash my face i need to shower and i need to put my jammies on um then i'm gonna do a little bit of reading i'm gonna read my bible and um then i'm gonna go to bed I'm trying not to stay up late like I was doing before. I'm trying to, you know, jump into a new routine, but a more healthier routine because sleep is something that I lack greatly. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And I'm also going to um, end the vlog here. So um, make sure you guys join the family, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you can be notified every single time that I upload. If you have been around for a while and you want to continue this journey with me, by all means do that. And if you're new and you want to continue and you want to start the journey with me, then um, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. 2024 is going to be an amazing year, um, not just for myself, but for everyone. So from me to you, from my mouth to God's ears, it's going to be an amazing year for you.